Hey, 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 we were Snappers. This is Tournament the Great. Welcome back to another exciting installment of Pokemon Sword. Uh, we are kicking off today with the DLC Isle of Armor. Um, it came out a month or a month and a couple weeks ago, potentially. Uh, and uh, I just wanted to wait and, and play through it when I could play through it with you guys, uh, experience it all together. I know it's only a handful of hours of content, so we could probably knock it out in a stream or two. Uh, so we'll just do the whole thing on stream together. Um, this is a continuation of my Pokemon Sword blind run that we did uh, as a channel. Uh, let's take a quick look. I've got a whole new team that I've put together um, for this because I heard that uh, uh, the levels, or what I saw from other people streaming and uh, talking to people, the levels for the Isle of Armor are, are much lower than, uh, it doesn't really scale to end game type uh, levels. So um, my, my actual team uh, is all the Pokemon you, we used during our series. We've got Brienne. You guys haven't seen Link, uh, my Zacian, I don't think. Because uh, I did not stream post-game stuff of, of Pokemon Sword uh, with the crazy Shield Burton Sword guy, uh, whatever. Uh, I didn't stream any of that, so you guys, I didn't catch Zacian with you. Uh, Kays, thank you so much for the host. I gotta update those alerts, apparently. Um, but uh, so, but other than that, we've got Dandelion and Sir Galahad and Gala and, and Soka uh, and Brienne. Uh, and then everybody else, uh, we've got a, we got a Zerorora here who we got from the, uh, some, some sort of, uh, mystery gift thing. Um, I trained up this Dragapult, it was something I got on mystery gift, but, uh, yeah, so basically these are the Pokemon we had, but for the most part, they're, they're almost 80, uh, and for the most part, it sounds like the DLC is nowhere near those levels, so, um... What I've done is instead raised up a whole nother team of Pokemon. Some of these, uh, my, my, I'm kind of blocking them there, I can see in the stream. Um, some of these I, I bred, well actually all of these I bred, except for Blue, um, who uh, can't be bred. Uh, but I wanted to just try out a smattering of, uh, of other Pokemon um, that, uh, that I hadn't really gotten a chance to do in either of my other playthroughs, whether in my blind run or with the Brolock, which we did with Kuya. Uh, and so we've got some of that going on uh, here today. We've got Tyrion, uh, my Impidimp, who uh, has since evolved into a Grimmsnarl. Um, my plan was to use Impidimp in my first playthrough because I just loved Impidimp so much. But then when I saw Grim its evolutions, I just was real turned off. Um, in the intervening time, Grimmsnarl has actually grown on me. It's not my favorite Pokemon by any means, uh, but it's grown on me enough that I was like, okay, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use the line. I really like the. Uh, the typing and everything, so I figured, okay, we'll do that. So we've got Tyrion, the Grimmsnarl. All these Pokemon have been bred to be perfectly competitively viable, uh, and I also uh, I also uh, EV trained them and everything. So they should be uh, pretty good, probably better than they need to be. Um, Kuya, how's it going, buddy? Thank you so much for the raid. How's everybody doing today? Welcome, uh, uh, Kuya's Brotherhood virus. How's everybody doing? And Latortoise is awake, so there we go. Uh, hi to Quackable and uh, Kays and uh, uh, Kuya and uh, everybody, Foxy, uh, everybody who's uh, popping in right now. Welcome, welcome. Uh, just quick running through the new team I've put together. We're just, just jumping off with the uh, Pokemon Sword uh, Isle of Armor DLC. Masters, how's it going, buddy? Uh, so there's Tyrion. We've got Blue, the Arctazult. Um, just had a fun typing that I wanted to play around with. I love unique typings, so I figured we'd try that. Um, we've got Pippin. My uh, my shiny uh, uh, Applin, um, which I would love to um, I would love to evolve Pippin into a Appleton. Um, I've got a separate shiny uh, uh, Applin that I've, I've uh, hatched for Flapple. I would love to evolve this thing into an Appleton. If there's anybody in the audience today who has a sweet Apple, I think they fixed the tra trading stuff. I know it was real borked when the DLC first came out. Um, thank you everybody for the follows, by the way, that are coming through. Thank you so much for those. Uh, if everybody has, anybody has a sweet apple, uh, and, uh, and they'd be interested in trading at some point, uh, yeah, Kays, let's do that real quick. Uh, if you want to get that set up, shoot, shoot me a code, and, uh, we'll, we'll do that real quick. Uh, I'll finish walking through my team while you get set up. Um, then we've got Mrs. Pot, oh, we've got Mrs. Potts, which was the first shiny I, I ever, uh, shiny hatched, uh, Mrs. Potts. I just love... Poltergeist, uh, and so I wanted to get the shiny of that. So we've got Mrs. Potts, our Poltergeist, which we will be evolving today as well. And then we've got Saffron, our uh, our shiny uh, Slowbro. So this is the team that I'm going to be taking into the DLC. Um, and then the final slot on the team will be... Um, 
<laughs> well, that's a virus that's carried over from the mixer days. My bot just has still got that set up. Uh, but yeah, so that's the team. We've got uh, Grimmsnarl, Arctazolt, uh, Will be Appleton, uh, Poltergeist, and uh, Scalarian Slowbro, and then obviously Urshifu. Um, <clears throat> Chip. Well, it is is currently Chip, um, but we will be evolving. In fact, we'll do that right now. Um, until uh, I get a whisper, or, well, don't whisper me, Kays, because I don't know how whispers, Twitch whispers work with, I'm look, work, using slobs, um, but let's, I did, I was putting, uh, held items on here, and I realized I did, in fact, have a chipped pot, or a cracked pot, um, so we're gonna go ahead and use this, and we'll evolve Mrs. Potts right now, uh, I wanted to, any of the evolutions that I could save, um, I wanted to go ahead and do that, and we do it on stream, what? Mrs. Potts is evolving? Kuya has 10 sweet apples, so yeah. Um, I have um, I have some good Pokemon to trade, or tart apples, uh, gold Pokemon and tart apples. Um, Mrs. Potts wants to learn the move Tea Time. I have no idea what Tea Time is, but let's uh, let's check it out. Uh, tea Time is a normal type move. User has Tea Time with all the Pokemon in battle. Each Pokemon eats its held berry. Nope, not doing that. Uh, yeah, let's give up on, on that. Um, Gonna try to learn anything else? Nope. All right. Yeah. Well, her her move set's uh, generally pretty much where I want it to be anyway, so that's fine. Um, okay. So um, let me. In fact, I will. Um, let me let me set up a a trade. Uh, let's just uh, let's do a link trade. Uh, we'll set a link code, and um, we're gonna do my channel anniversary. Uh, April 22nd, 2013, it was when Tortimer was born. So let's go ahead and set that as our link code. 0422-2013 is the link code. Uh, if anybody has a sweet apple, um, I, will, uh, I, will, I will take it off your hands. I have uh, to offer, uh, you guys can take your pick, whoever I guess gets it first. Um... But I've got a large selection of perfect Pokemon. So if anybody wants a perfect Appleton, or a perfect Milotic, or a perfect Rickety, or Poltegeist, or Flapple, or Wooloo, or Berserker, um, lots of things, <laughs> lots of things to choose. Um, I also have many five IV. So let's uh, everything but the lowered stat is perfect. So these are basically perfect, uh, except for the Dree. Well, no, yeah, I guess I have that one Dreepy that's. Almost perfect. Anyway, um, but uh, uh, zero four two two. Here, I'll I'll put it in chat. Zero four two two twenty thirteen is the uh, is the trade code. Uh, so yeah, and I can I can uh, we can we can do some well we'll do some more trading later potentially. But so whoever whoever can get me first with a sweet apple so I can evolve my apple uh, applin into an appleton. Um, and then we'll, uh, we'll go from there. Hopefully they've more or less... Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait. I, I've screwed this up. Um, I'm not connected to the internet. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I knew I forgot something. So let's do that. <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, there we go. Now connected to the internet. Now it's a race. Hold on. Uh, okay, I'm still broadcasting. So I guess we'll leave that going hopefully that still uh still works i see a stamp from k's popping up there um but uh but yes so this whole team has been ev trained and all that uh so pretty excited to see how they do i've not actually <laughs> you paired with kuya that's funny probably because i keep going into menus stop that um let me get off your bike um but uh yeah so i have not actually used any of these pokemon in battle uh but, because uh, I, I was using my Zacian to do all the EV training and, and leveling and things like that. I was just running through the champion, uh, running through the champion tournament over and over again to, to level them up. Oh, a trade partner's been found. Who got it? Kuya! All right, Kuya, what do you want? And, and Kaze, I'll, I'll trade you whatever Pokemon you want out of this, this batch at some other time. Uh, in fact, anybody, join my Discord. I need to get rid of some of these Pokemon. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, so Kuya, what would you like? Uh, I've got a bunch of perfect IV Pokemon. You would like a perfect Riolu. All right. Uh, do I have... 
Male or female? I, I'm going to give you a male because <laughs> I only have the one female. Uh, so let's do that. Uh, and you are trading a snom that uh, ideally has a sweet apple on it. Dude, I've not spurned anybody. I've never gotten a sweet apple. Uh, the the Anytime I've tried in the past, they... Uh, um, Anytime I've tried in the past, the it was right after the DLC came out, and the, the like we it wouldn't pair us in partners. It's like there's an eight digit code, but it still wouldn't pair us. It was taking like a half hour, and this is the first time I've ever connected to somebody <laughs> since the DLC came out. So, um, I will uh, case obviously anything you want out of this batch, you you can have it at a, at a later date. All right, so we've got a snom, which will hopefully have uh, hopefully have our sweet apple, and then we can get our apple and evolved. All right, we're gonna go ahead and quit. All right, so let's, let's check it out here. Sweet apple. Um, all right, we're gonna actually, we are gonna move this. Let's get it out of my perfect boxes. Uh, and we'll just put it in a random living dex box. All right, thank you so much, Kuya. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, we're gonna take that sweet apple and then we are going to feed it to Pippin. Uh, should we need to... I think, if I remember correctly, you just feed it. It's not like a they hold it and level up thing, right? Uh, but let's uh, let's attempt to feed it, at least, and hope that that works. All right. Use this item. Yep, on Pippin. All right. Now we are going to have our fantastic shiny Appleton. Super excited for Pippin. Pippin's going to be my specially defensive Pokemon. I've got Slowbro for my physically defensive Pokemon. Fantastic. I love the shinies of this line. This is These are probably... Uh, Fla I prefer Flapple over Appleton, uh, but uh, Flapple is probably my favorite Pokemon uh, from from this new generation. All right. Uh, so real quickly, um, now that we've uh, spent 15 minutes uh, doing this, let me quickly... Uh, we're going to talk to this guy, and I, they're level six, my Pokemon are level 60, so I'm going to guess that there are some moves that we can teach Pippin. And uh, let's just see. Okay, I think I do want Leech Seed. So let's go ahead and do that. I don't have the list pulled up in front of me, so I can't remember exactly what I want on it. Apple Acid, I th think, was the one... Eighty base power. tart apples. It tart apples. We just ate a sweet apple. Also lowers the target special defense. And this also lowers the special defense. Why wouldn't I want energy ball? I think we're gonna go energy ball. Uh, we're to withdraw. All right, Kuya. Enjoy your lunch. <clears throat> All right, and then we'll go ahead and. Teach Pippin, I think Dragon Pulse probably as well. Get it with both stabs. Okay, and then I can worry about the rest of it. I think... I'll, I'll, I'll double check it later. I think maybe we want to throw Recover on it too. Although we've got potions, I'm not going to bother with Recover. So we'll just, we'll just do that for the time being. Um, and I'll figure out uh, the rest of what we want on Applin, uh, later. Okay, uh, yes, train station. So, we, we're gonna head into the Isle of Armor. Um, alright, so now everybody is evolved except for Saffron, which we have to actually get the items, um, in the Isle of Armor. Oh, Apple Acid always drops. Okay, I missed that, uh, clarifying feature, I guess. Okay, which station do I want to go to? Wow, Motostoke, Hallberry, White Hill, Winden. Wait, how do I... Do I have to buy like a... Next to the... Okay, talk to this guy. Uh, that's an armor patch. With that patch, you can go to the... Thank you, Fly Guy. <laughs> uh, where'd you like to go today? Armor Stadium, or Station. There we go. Thank you for like, uh, I'm like, wait, how do I get there? I've not played this yet, so uh, that's, uh, that's good. It's gonna, is it like an underground? Oh no, we, we jump on a Corviknight. Yeah, 
Flygon's my, uh, my Bulbapedia. Fantastic. The Isle of Armor. Here we go. <laughs> and thank you, Case, for handling that as well. Um, all right. Fantastic. My first four years. I was planning on potentially playing this with my side account um, and uh, just never got around to it. This is your first visit to the Isle of Armor? I'm researching Pokemon biology here on the island. If you want to register the Pokemon, you can catch on the island in your Pokedex, right? I looked at your Pokedex, so you can do just that. Fantastic. There are a number of Pokemon that have been added with the Isle of Armor, um, older Pokemon that have been added in, that I am interested in, in doing some breeding with at some point. I would love to get me a shiny, uh, perfect Azumarill. Um, oop, nope, we're not sitting down. Um, and I would love to get a shiny, perfect uh, Lycanroc. Although I need to find somebody, I need to find somebody who's uh, got a uh, uh, a rock ruff that can turn into dusk form lichen rock. I would love to get a shiny dusk form lichen rock, um, but I've got to find somebody who's got one of those to trade to me. I don't have one from the event uh, back in Sumo. Uh, I'm supposed to join the dodo on this island today, but there's a strange person standing outside the station. I'm a bit scared to head out. You've got a dusk form one. Is dusk form what I want? But I've been burned. <laughs> <laughs> well, Kays, if you trade me your Dusk Form one, I will uh, I will give you any Pokemon you want. Ah, uh -huh, there you are. Right on time, too. You're pretty punctual for a kid. Um, hey, have we met before or something? No, it doesn't really matter, I guess. The one thing I don't love is that because you can do this DLC at any point, like if you're starting the game fresh, you can do it. They didn't build it to be endgame DLC, which is a little obno obnoxious, if I'm being honest. But um, the one thing I don't like is that like n I I'm the champion of the region. And this, this region is all about their champions. And and nobody recognized me at any point throughout the course of this, I, I don't believe. So, I am Clara. I've been at the dojo a while, so they sent me to help out the newbie. Good dojo. Oh, come on. I know you're the new student who's supposed to join the Master Dojo. What's going on? Am I being mocked by a kid? But I'm the colorful, caring, and charisma charismatic Clara. Well then, how about we have a quick battle? Just so you know... Just so you know, we can see who's better. I'll be waiting outside, so come out when you're ready. All right, let's do it. Clara is greater than Avery. He'll never know what hit him. Girl, you don't even know I'm the champion. You're not going to know what hit you. I feel like my shoes are wrong. Where, uh, I screwed up my shoes at some point. I've got my uh, Galar uh, region champion outfit going on. Much sportier than uh, when we played through uh, the game together. <laughs> I think I was wearing like a sweater vest when we played through the game together. But now I'm the champion, so I've got to be, uh, got to be all sporty. All right. <laughs> I bet this is your first time on the Isle of Armor. Yep. I bet you can't wait to start exploring, but first things first. Actually, I just want to run through the story. I'm not going to be running through around exploring a ton on camera, probably. Uh, except for when the story requires it. We need to make sure you're ready, since I've already been at the Master Dojo for a little while now. I'll be the one testing you out. Go easy on me, okay? This will be very interesting. Uh, this is this is my uh, first time using all of these Pokemon, basically. <laughs> so uh, I, I had Zacian basically running them through their paces before. All right, we've got Tyrion up front. But this is good. This is what I want. I wanted to try out some new Pokemon, and so this will be good. Uh, all right, Tyrion. We've got Bug Poison. We're really not uh, matched here. Let's... Bug poison. <clears throat> Let me bring blue out. I don't have a ground type, which I recognized as I was thinking about earlier. Maybe a bit of a, a weakness. Um, well, this is the first uh, fossil I've used in this generation too. Look at the damage you first damage you took on the Isle of Armor. Considered a little gift for me. Okay, uh, I guess I'll do that. Let's uh, freeze dry you. Boom, baby. Critical hit, even. Fantastic. Yeah, I, realizing that fly. <laughs> Saffron can... I, I mean, I could have psychic it, too, I guess. But uh, obviously, if it came out with a bug-type move, it would have hurt a little bit. Um, we'll have to get something on somebody to handle that stuff. But uh, I was about to send out Slowpoke. Now we'll switch. Yep, we'll switch Pokemon. Because Slowpoke, it's a glaring Slowpoke, which... Um, in fact, let's use Mrs. Potts, my my beautiful uh, shiny Poltergeist, the first shiny I ever bothered Masuda breeding. Look at her, she's fantastic. All right, 
I don't even think I'm probably going to have to Shell Smash here. Um, so let's go ahead and just uh, Shadow Ball. <laughs> Poltergeist is probably one of my other favorite Pokemon. This is the first time I'm using one, but I've just, I just loved the design from the very beginning. So uh, very excited to have the opportunity to uh, make a new team for this. I'm so mad. <clears throat> Her stupid bow is such a red herring. Her stupid bow is a Dustox bow, but the only new Pokemon they added in this in this was the Galarian Slowbro and then the Legendary. That's true. I could I could slap an Eviolite on uh, on Slowbro. Not good, not good at all, man. How'd this kid get so strong? I'm the champion of the region. Now this kid joins the dojo. Nobody's gonna pay attention to my strength. I could just tell him to buzz off. No, they asked me to bring in the new student. No, I, I understand, <clears throat> but, like, why would you show all of the content you're adding in a new thing? Like, I, Pokemon was pretty good about being pretty low-key with what they revealed in the in the marketing for Sword and Shield. In the past, they've showed everything. At this time, they were pretty low-key, so I I don't know. I, I got myself typed, absolutely, but it doesn't make me any more mad. Less mad. I mean, it's not like I was going to go all out, not at all, but still. But, you see, our dojo is one that's got a long-standing reputation. Even the famous champion Leon trained at our place. No offense, but maybe, just maybe, you're not quite good enough to make it? So how about this? Why not enjoy the sights, but just stay away from the Master Dojo over there, okay? I mean, I beat Leon, so... <clears throat> well, I mean, she should just recognize me, you know, my face. Um... But yes, I do have an entirely different team. Cause I didn't want I didn't want to I didn't want to bowl them over too much. All right, style card. I don't know what that does. It increases the selection of boutiques in hair salon. Ooh, new clothes options. All right, just so when you visit a boutique or hair salon, and they'll let you buy stuff that's not available to most people. Anyway, I guess that's that. See you never. Nah, girl, I'm coming right behind you. Uh, all right, <clears throat> everybody. Yeah, I think we're good. All right, I do think. Yeah, let's 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 move some things around. Um, I have an EV light here, and Flygon's right. We should pop that on. Give to Saffron. At least until we can collect the Galerica twigs that we need. Um. Yeah, I mean you can do it at any point. You can go straight there from Wedgehurst, I think. Um, and then I'm going to give this leftovers to Pippin. Um, I wish they had just decided to make it endgame content so they could, I don't know, just build on the content of the game a little bit more. But, um, I think trying to make it accessible at any point in the game probably weakens it overall. Um, but, uh, <gasps> ooh, it's a rock raft! Hi, buddy! All right. <clears throat> I don't want to get distracted, though, because I do have a... I do have a limited stream time these days. Uh, for those of you guys who have not been around, uh, I had a, a, a son. My baby was born. Uh, oop, we got the diglets here. Uh, in mid-March, uh, which is partially why you guys have not seen me, except for like one stream last week since then. Um, and uh, my wife is going to be staying home with him, which means that my usual uh, lunchtime streams are, are not going to be as easy to pull off. Um, this guy is just like at 150 diglets scattered around the island that I then have to find. Um, we're gonna blow past this a little bit, but um, uh, so but since she's not going back to work and he's not going to daycare, that means that my just guaranteed free time for lunch streams is not always necessarily gonna be guaranteed. Uh, I'm gonna work out that I can stream, you know, once or twice a week still, hopefully, um, probably starting with once, and we'll see how it goes. But uh, uh, but yeah, so, um, next week, though, I am gonna be out of town, uh, yeah, we'll find his other Diglett, I don't remember what the, I think, I think if you find all these Diglett, no, uh, completing the decks gets you some sort of mark charm or, or title charm or something, I don't know what completing the Diglett gets you, um, oh, that's right, you get some sort of special, you get a hidden ability, a lowland starter or something, if you finish it or something, that's right, um, all right, anyway, um, he literally just gives you an Alolan Diglett <laughs> for complete. Dude, this guy's got the uh, Chairman Rose's haircut. All right, we'll have to we'll have to check out the boutique styles at uh, at some point. We got Clefkeys and Jigglypuffs. 
We can get ourselves a Wigglytuff. That'd be fun. Uh, we've already got our fairy type, though. Um, oh, you give him a Lowland stuff, and he gives you just normal Diglets. That's so dumb. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, fiddlesticks, our new student decided to go back home. Seems that way. Yep, I did my best to welcome him, but he just suddenly left after our battle. And I've been hoping we'd get to welcome a new member to our little family here, too. Well, hello, and who are you, love? Huh? Ah, ah, ah. Of course, you must be the new student that's supposed to join the dojo today. Right, 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 exactly, ma'am. I swear he must have changed his mind about joining the dojo. Oh, but here you are. I'm so happy you decided to come after all. Oh, everything's just coming up roses. Now I'm quite sure they already told me your name, but... Uh, it's Tortobar. <clears throat> that's right, you're Tortobar. Of course you are, love. Well, I'm rather sure that's not the name I was told before. My name's Honey. I help keep this place running. You can consider me the lady of the house. Not that the Master Dojo is just any old house. Arg, why, how? Uh, what is he that he's doing just showing up like that? This ain't good. Miss Honey will know that I lied. Seems like you've already met our Clara, a bit of an old ducklet, but she's one of our own. She's training hard here at the dojo so she can become a gym leader someday. I can trust the two of you to get along, right? No, I want to be the poison gym leader. Forget her. Hee <clears throat> hee hey, I'm sure we'll be best friends. Oh dear, but look at me. Here I am making you stand right outside if you've come all this way. Come in, come in. Don't mind the faint stench of sweat. Gross. Get a mop out or something. Listen, you. If you dare tell us honey about what happened at the station... I'll melt you down to size, you understand? You have no idea who you're dealing with, lady. Hey, it's our cub foo. Alright. We're going to be going for water form? Whatever the water fighting uh, cub foo is. Because I've already got a dark type with, uh, with Grim Snarl. Uh, so I figured for uh, keeping my types uh, varied, we would go uh, water fighting. Um, <clears throat> all right. Rapid strike. There we go. Everybody, I have an announcement to make. We've got a new student joining us today. Please welcome Totema. I'm sure you'll all have lots to teach him. Hiya! Welcome to the dojo. All our students are so good and hardworking. Everybody really likes that they're all around here. Now here's, now here's someone who's not listening to my database of students. Hello, sweetie pie. It's not usual for you to bother greeting a newcomer. This is Hyde, my darling only son. Are you some kind of outlier? Here, you should give this a try. Tame the experience charm. What's that do? Charm that increases the XP points Pokemon can get. A machine-like object is inside the charm. Increases the XP points that Pokemon can get? Is that like a team-wide lucky egg? Or does it increase the total experience? So like you can... I don't know. Uh, but don't open it, okay? It's got tech I developed inside, and I don't want you to go and ruin it. <clears throat> yes, it's a team-wide uh, lucky egg. Okay. Should have got that before I did all my grinding. He's so sweet with his hands, always making something new. Such a clever boy. And that handsome gent in the back is my darling hubby and the very master of the Master Dojo. She's a little uh, a little young for uh, old Grey Poupon over here, isn't she? <clears throat> Why, hello there. My name is Mustard. I'm rather good at Pokemon battles, you know. I'm pleased as cheese that you could join us. Cheese to meet ya. <laughs> I see you've got a sense of humor too. Good, good. He's a cradle snatcher. Tempted to fool you into thinking he's just a silly old man. He's a real beast when he gets serious. Well, darling, I'll leave the rest up to you. Yay! This is my favorite part. I just, I want to see how good you are. So why don't we have a battle with little old me? Just say the word when you're ready. Yeah, man. Let's do it. Yahoo! Are you ready for a battle? Absolutely. All right, let's get this show started. This is the best way to get to know new students. Polyrath. All right, Grey Poupon, what you got, buddy? Mianfu. All right, I think Tyrion's up front. Yippee! Now I just can't wait to see you battle your heart out. All right. Spirit break. All right. 
Boom, baby. Ooh, super duper effective. Uh-oh, I smell danger. Yup. Uh, all that uh, perfect breeding and EV training paying off. Uh-oh, Pippin's level 61. There was my uh, OCD. He's about to send out Shinx. Let me switch your Pokemon. Who haven't we used yet? I guess we've not used Pippin. Let's let's bring in Pippin. Shinx isn't gonna have anything to do uh, do against uh, do against him. Shiny. Oh, looks like my little old self's been cornered. Oh no, not my physical attack stat. What will I ever do? enough to one shot that's a little disappointing that's okay Pippin's not a uh, not intended to be a, an attacker primarily uh, I know it's a little early in the morning for me to do this but honey and mustard are married honey and mustard yeah there you go I'm surprised their son's name isn't some sort of uh, pun based on that critical hit yeah what luck favors you like that it's a sure sign you're a good trainer I don't know if it's luck I Obsessively brought all these and trained all these Pokemon. I would go with skill. Defeated Dojo Master Mustard. That was everything I'd hoped for and more. All right, we're in. <laughs> I lost. You're pretty strong, aren't you? Hey, the newbie won. Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Who's that kid anyway? I'm the champion of the region. Uh, the way you battled really shows me how much you care about your Pokemon. Even if you become, if you've come because of a misunderstanding, as long as you have the will to learn, and you're welcome at the Master Dojo. I think we can all help each other become stronger. I'm happy you've come to join us. On that note, here's your Dojo uniform. Got a Dojo uniform. Hey, Jay, how's it going, buddy? All right. With that on, you'll fit right in with my students of my Master Dojo. Hey, you newbie. If you want to change or just take a break, use that room over there. All right. Now then, with Tormer here, the dojo's at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You'll be facing three trials. Three trials? What have these people have been doing? Like, is this a whole new class? But they said I'm a newbie. So, like, what have they been doing all this time if, like, they've just been sitting around waiting for me to get this stuff going? Um, wait, why is there a max capacity for this dojo? <laughs> and there's more. The person who completes all three trials will receive the secret armor of this dojo. Oh, a secret set of armor. I want it. Heh, <laughs> that's the spirit. Now, let me explain the first trial. Ah, but Master, you haven't given me my uniform yet. Why does that kid get a uniform but not me? It's not fair. Again, hasn't she been here a while? Oh, dear. Do you really not have a uniform? My bad, my bad. That's easy to fix, though. I have another uniform right here for you, Clara. Hee-hee! <laughs> the squeaky wheel gets the grease. Clara got the dough. Whoa! What was that? Well, it's gone. Where'd my doctor uniform go? Po po Huh? Poke! That speed, was it really these slow pokes? I've never seen any slow poke move so fast. Hey, give it back, give me my doctor uniform. Slow, slow. Poke! <laughs> uh, so the slow poke get uh, an ability in, in this, this, um, Master, what's up with the Slowpoke in this uh, DLC? Uh, Galarian Slowpoke uh, get an ability that allows them to uh, move first. It's like a, a built-in quick claw, basically. This is my first. This is the first trial, my students. You've all got to chase after those fast Slowpoke, trained with care by little old me. That, but that's not all. You need to defeat them too. And while you're at it, could you get Clara's Dojo uniform back? Ah, uh, do we have to? Well, at that, do your best, Yella. All right. All right, so we'll get to do a little bit of exploration here. I don't remember exactly where these end up. 
Um, but I think it basically is just a, a way to force you to kind of explore the island a little bit. Uh, so we'll go, uh, we'll go, uh, do you want to change back into your usual clothes? Uh, nah, we'll, um, well, maybe let's, let's, can I wear, like, can I put my hat back on? Change my outfit. All right, so. Okay, so no, I can't wear a hat with the top bun. Um. Huh. All right. Well, we'll just uh, we'll just leave it for now. Um. All right. <clears throat> the hat was really the only thing I I wanted to wanted to mess with. Um. Quackable, if you just quack and chat one more time, I'm just gonna have my mods ban you. So just uh, talk like a person, or don't. <laughs> All right, so we've got Slowpokes. They are rushing out into the uh, wild blue yonder. Um, and uh, I guess are they all going to be out in this one field? I guess we'll find out. All right. Seem to have an awesome bike. Let me customize it if you'd like. Lady, does it not look like I've got better things going on at the moment? All right. So at least one of these guys... Oh, I see him. Boom, baby. All right, slowpoke number one. <laughs> Kay's already timed him out earlier, too. Don't think he, don't think he got the memo. All right. Uh, Darkest Lariat. Doesn't affect me. <laughs> Boom, baby. All right. I'll take it. Well, whichever. All right. Beauty. One slowpoke down. Now, are they all out here? They all took back Clara's dojo jacket. Two slowpokes left. All right. Um... They all looked like they were kind of rushing out here, but my guess is that they're going to be in different areas of the map. Okay, wait, there's one over here. My bike feels slow. Is it slower than normal? Did it get nerfed? All right. Defeat and take back the dojo uniform. All right. We'll let Tyrion handle these guys. You psych up! Uh, and then we'll... Uh, We'll give somebody else a shot for the next uh, for the next challenge. Okay. Po. Dojo T and Dojo Shorts. Okay, so my guess is that they are out here somewhere. Oh, little. Uh, in fact, let me. I'm gonna disconnect. Just because I'm feeling a little bit of lag. My guess is loading all the uh, internet people probably doesn't uh, doesn't help. Poke it all. All right. Hey, hey! I disconnected. Why? Why you? Why you here? Anyway, uh, slope. Is he out here? Or... Oh, yep. Yeah. Found him! Oh, no! No! Where'd he go? Got him! Grabbing a Zerorora? Why do I, why do I need a Zerorora? <laughs> Uh, all right. Darkest Lariat. Heal pulse. You healing me or you? Oh, me. Thank you, Slowpoke. I greatly appreciate that. Super effective. All right. Trial number one is completed.
Dojo gloves and dojo legwear. To go back all the closer, you should tell Master Mustard. All right. Oh no! A whooper! Um, Zorua. Right, not Zerora. That's a different Pokemon. Zorua. All right. I do want to check before we go zipping off too much. Looks like there's a TM here. Muddy water, right? Not bad. Oh gosh! Buffalo wanted blood. Run! Alrighty. So it's pretty rare, and the next time you can get it is in a certain foggy areas, which you can only access after beating the whole story. Ah. Well, I'm not too worried about it. Uh, I might don't really have any intention of completing the decks in the DLC here. Because, honestly, the reward for doing so means nothing to me. I don't care, so <laughs> probably not going to bother. Uh, oh, Tartabur, welcome back! Ew, don't tell me you got my uniform back all on your own! Here you go. Give the Dodo uniform to Clara. Oh, well, uh, thanks. Well, Mustard Tartabur, you cleared the first trial like it was nothing. Why, I think this is the first time since Leon that someone has been able to handle all three fast slowpoke on their own. The rest of you tried very hard, too. You were able to catch up to the slowpoke, but I guess you couldn't defeat them. Ugh. Tell you what, anyone who was able to catch up to a slowpoke at least once gets a pass. Tortimer really outdid himself, so it's only fair everyone else gets another chance. Try to make a comeback, everybody. Oh, how generous. You mean you guys couldn't beat those slowpokes? <laughs> Figured chasing it was probably the hard part. Alright, or at least one little kid got eliminated. Oh, that reminds me, honey. Where are those little ones? Oh, that's right, Oh, <gasps> I forgot about this. I'd nearly forgotten. Squirtle, Bubsor, come on in, sweeties. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Drip? Why are you... Uh, their names are Bulbasaur and Squirtle, not Drip and Vine. They say their names. That's how it works. All right. These are our sweet little Pokemon, Bulbasaur and Squirtle. We've all been taking care of them together. And I'd say you're they're more than a little curious about your strength as a trainer. Why don't you pick one to get for yourself? You did succeed in the trial, after all. And just so you know, these two have been raised in a very special way. When they evolve, they'll be able to check into Max. Um, okay, so since I know... Well, it, th that's not really a determining factor necessarily, but... I know that at some point uh, in the course of this, this DLC, I'm going to be able to create a, a soup or something that will allow any Pokemon whose species is capable of Gigantamaxing to Gigantamax. I don't really care about Gigantamaxing much to begin with, but I have already bred up a perfect shiny Vault Venusaur uh, for my Gold Squadron team because it's, it's shiny as yellow and I love it. Um, I do not have a, a Squirtle yet, uh, and so what I will probably do is uh, I will I will just make a soup for my existing Venus or Bulbasaur, and I will I will take this Gigantamaxing Squirtle uh, for now. Wow! So you're going to go with a little Squirtle. It's great with water type moves. Yep, we are taking the Gigantamaxing Squirtle. Um, Squirtle became your Pokemon. It's probably too low a level to be um, of any use. I guess he's at level five or whatever. But uh, tiny turtle Pokemon. So it's been added to your party. I already had a Squirtle in this DLC, but uh, apparently it wasn't in the decks yet because I didn't have the, the DLC decks. Squirtle looks pleased as punch. Um, <clears throat> so we'll need to make sure that we uh, that we, we get this little dude up to snuff because uh, we don't actually have um, uh, we don't actually have a Water type until we get our Urshifu. So we'll uh, we'll have to. Uh... <laughs> yes, I would pick Squirtle. Uh, I love Bulbasaur and Venusaur and everything, but, uh, I've already got a, a perfect one. So, might as well take the Squirtle and, uh, we'll, uh, use him while we can. So, we'll, um, <clears throat> we'll keep him on the team, uh, and, uh, let him level up. And, uh, and then, uh, we'll, if, if, if he gets leveled enough, then we'll use him until we get our Urshifu. Um, 
And don't you worry, Bubble Sword, I'll be sure to raise you with lots of love. I'll make you so, oh, so strong, you'll never lose to Squirtle. I mean, he probably won't lose to Squirtle anyway. He's got the type advantage. Um, Miss Honey, if you want that Pokemon to learn new moves, you can leave that to me. Why are you the sweetest thing? All right, so yeah, this guy's some sort of move tutor. That lovely lad is always so kind. Give him a bit of armor right or he'll teach your darling new Pokemon a new move. You should give it a try. That pieces of armor right or. Uh, but yes, so we will, uh, I guess we can check this out. I think we're supposed to. Obviously, she gave us some so we can do the tutorial thing. Um, see if there's nothing we can't teach some people on our team. And then we'll, uh, I, I missed. We, well, we gotta go pick some mushrooms or something. I'm completely assisted with moves. In the supervision of my master, I've been developing new Pokemon moves day and night. Spent a lot of time developing many moves. We'll teach a Pokemon move for small token of gratitude. Yes. Which Pokemon do you want me to teach a move to? Uh, burning Jealousy. It's a... Special, Rising Voltage, Special, Grassy Glide, these are all the wrong, Triple Axle, Consecutive 3 Kick Attack that becomes more powerful when you successful hit, Close of Gas, Scorching Sands, Poltergeist, yeah they're all the wrong, like when I want them to be special they're physical and all right, we'll hold off on that for uh, the Bulbasaur won't lose to Squirtle, but rather the rest of Torsi. Well, yes. Um, all right, so we'll worry about that at a later date. Uh, we've got to go find some Max Mushrooms. Um, and one thing we do need to be doing as well, now that we're going to be out exploring a little bit. Hey, Tortimer, my bad, my bad. we got to be on the lookout for some Galerica Twigs, too, so we can make the Galerica Cuff and evolve our Slowbro. Just don't me that you're brand new to the Isle of Armor. I bet you have no idea where to even begin looking for Max Mushrooms. Come on, let's go for a walk and I'll show you some Mushroom Hotspots. Sure, Gramps. dum dee 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 la 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 This guy reminds me, at least in my brain, he reminds me of Boomy from uh, Avatar. Now, usually, the forested focus is chock full of max mushrooms, but the thing is, a swarm of Greedon came through and ate every last one here. So I'm thinking that maybe you'll have more luck finding max mushrooms if you go check Warm Up Tunnel. It's out on the other side of the forest. Just watch where you're going in the forest, okay? It's easy to get lost. Anywho, good luck with the hunt for max mushrooms. Catch you back at the dojo. All right, gonna pass through the forest. Got to keep an eye out for little sparkly bits at the foot of trees. I think that's primarily where we're gonna be finding Galerica twigs. It's digging maw. Don't really need digging maw at the moment. Pikachu. Didn't think of any mushrooms sure they need to. Yeah. Unfortunately, it doesn't seem like there's a ton of actual battling in, uh... Ooh. That guy's cool. I think he's just mono-fighting. I've never actually used him. I got him for my, uh, sumo dex. Tiny mushroom. Not what I need. Um, I got him for my sumo dex, but I've never actually used him. I think he's mono-fighting, and his... Uh, his alternate form was, uh, oh, there's a TM here. Let's grab that. Um, I think his, his version exclusive counterpart was Mono Psychic or something. Quackable because saying quack adds nothing to the conversation. Ooh, Sludge White. Oh, it's a TR. Dang it. Um, it's, it adds nothing to the conversation. So why would I need you repeatedly spamming quack in the chat? <laughs> Hang out and chat, or don't. Either way works. A mulga up in the tree. Just gotta clear out some of the obvious stuff while we're here. Leafstone. Orangur is psychic normal. Interesting. I guess that's not a unique type because we've got we've had uh, giraffe rig. Since, since Gen uh, Gen 2. <laughs> no problem, Cody. We haven't made too much progress. I mean, we've made some progress, but uh, we... 
There we go. There's our first Galerica twig. Uh, we um, we did the first trial, and now we're uh, we're heading to find some max mushrooms. Is this the? No, this, yeah, this is the way we want to go. Um, keeping a lookout for some Galerica twigs as we go because I want to evolve my uh, slow bro as quickly as I can. If there's another way to find them besides just like, uh... yeah, why not? Uh, Tentacruel. Um, if there's an easier way, yeah, so you have to, to, to evolve Galarian Slowpoke, you have to find, uh, I think eight Galerica Twigs, and then there's some lady out on an out island that'll turn the Galerica Twigs into a Galerica Cuff, which is the item that you use to evolve, uh, um... Used to evolve the slow pokes. If there's a if there's a way besides just finding them at foot of trees, oh, it's a diglet. Um, then uh, let me know. I don't want to waste time looking for uh, looking for them out in the wild. If there's like a place I can just buy them or something. All right. I checked these tree. Yeah, I checked these trees already because I remember that shelmet. Max potion. Upgrade. Ooh. Did Porygon get added in the DLC? All right. It's going in the cave here. Got to keep on looking. Ooh, Sandshrew. I love Sandshrew so much. Uh, there's a Diglett here. I guess I should probably, if I actually see him, I should grab him. I'm not going to spend a lot of time looking for him. It's only under trees. Yeah, then that makes sense. Should just chop a tree down. Get all the Galerica twigs I need. Thick club. Ooh, nice. I saw that there was Cubone in here too. Um, Alolan Marowak is one of my absolute favorite Pokemon these days. So I would not mind. Uh, I know there's like random NPC trainers and stuff scattered about. Um, I would not mind uh, getting myself an Alolan Marowak. All right. Max Mushrooms. Yes. Hold up a sec. Dude, you're way behind me there, Clara. <laughs> wait, wait. Hello, what's this? Three max mushrooms in one spot. Here, I thought I'd need to go find one by one. I saw those mushrooms first, I swear. I've been at the dojo longer and all, so it was only fair that you let me tap them, right? No way. Yeah, I figured that's what you'd say. Gosh, you're a pain in the neck. Just show up out of nowhere and just happen to be young and talented. If you're looking to get in my way, we'll look at some violet poisons. I'll take care of that. Honestly, lady, kind of like BD stole the fairy gym for me. I would love to be the psychic, or the 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 poison gym leader. So uh, you can just uh, you can just back right on off. I will take your spot. If you get enough diglet, you get a hidden ability, a lowland marowak. Ooh. What is uh, what is a lowland marowak's hidden ability? I, I don't. I'm not familiar. All right. Uh, right. Yes. Uh, Tyrion's pretty good at killing uh, killing slowpokes here. She's up to level 62 now. We're, uh, we haven't had much battling uh, available to us. I guess we battle wild Pokemon. Um, but Rockhead. Interesting. I have to, I'd have to look. I've mostly used... Um... Ooh, ooh! There, there goes that Squirtle. <laughs> I forgot we had him with us. Um, just barely not enough to... Um... Uh, probably not to worry too much about entry hazards. Uh, yeah, we'll learn bite. Um, throw a tail whip. Uh, he'll be a war turtle in no time. Crazy stuffed bread from Little Caesars. I have not. I yeah, it's I, I've not had Little Caesars since like college. Um, war gun. All right, and Clara's about to send out coughing. Yep, we'll switch our Pokemon. We have not seen Saffron in battle yet, I don't think. Um, and and uh, she is made for coughings. Oh, yeah? Well, we have to check it out. I think we've got a little season in town somewhere. <clears throat> Man, I wish shiny Galarian Weezing looked cooler.
All right. Well, we'll handle War Turtle at the end of this battle, so that's exciting. Yeah, protect would be useful. Actually, speaking of Gigantamax Blastoise and, and Tortoise just popping patron stuff in the chat, um, I just recently added a uh, Gigantamax Blastoise tier because all of my, my tiers is I've got like an Egg tier, a Squirtle tier, a War Turtle tier, a Blastoise tier, a Mega Blastoise tier, and now there is a Gigant Gigantamax Blastoise tier. Um, <laughs> I don't remember what I said the reward was for it, but I just, as soon as I saw Gigantamax Blastoise, I'm like, oh, I need to add a Gigantamax Blastoise tier. <laughs> so, uh,. Yeah, check that out. All right, uh, Saffron, did you? There we go. Did we not use Psychic? What happened? Yeah, not enough for the one shot. I went the more defensive than attacking for my Slowpoke, so I think the like the the premier set on Smogon is uh, is making it modest. I I have a calm, a calm Slowpoke. Here we go. All right, I don't have all, or don't level too much Squirtle. Rain Dance. Uh, we'll probably keep holding those. <clears throat> I love how easy it is to do the, use the move relearner in this game. Uh, don't really have to worry about what my Pokemon are learning at this point. <clears throat> and here we go, Galarian War Turtle. All right. Yeah, well, that's that's mostly what I meant, Flygon. I love how easy and free the root... Because it used to be what you had to go get, like, love scales or whatever. Like, you, you had to get these, like, rare items, and it's just a huge pain in the butt. It's so nice that you could just go do it for free at any time. Uh, it is recognized as a symbol of longevity. If its shell has algae on it, that war turtle is very old. Oh, now I need some fan art of me with an algae-covered war turtle. Old buddies. Ah! Missing. Fine, you can have those silly mushrooms. I'm gonna go find better ones anyway. So there. Oh no! Don't threaten me with a good time. Chain three clusters of max mushrooms. Goober's officially an old man. He just lost his first tooth. Oh man, Goober! They grew up too quick. Hello, is this Tortimer's phone? How's the trail coming along, love? Easy peasy. I mean, you've already managed to find three max mushrooms. I've been checking in on their British progress, but it seems you're the first one to place again. You really are a new versus star, aren't you? I suppose you better go put that pot on the stove, but be careful on your way back. Okay. All right, I think this is the last diglet for this area. Right. Yeah, there we go. I remembered it saying we only had one more, so I figured we'd grab that first. Oh, Cubone. All right. Cubone and, uh, and Sanchu are some of my favorites. I'm partial to ground types, but uh, they're just so cute. All right, let us head back, and uh, I think that's digging paw or something. I'm not messing with all that right now. Uh, let's head back and see if we can't get this story rolling. I'd love. Was there more? Crafty. I saw a tree. I wanted to see if there's a glare I could twig here. Does not appear that there is. Alright. Uh, gold duck. Nope, this isn't the way. I need to go find the forest. Here we are. Yeah, I remember back in the days, me, Jay, and K's be playing Pixelmon on the Decimon or PXO servers and uh, have Goober in the background crying up a storm. Oh, wow, you have been busy uh, playing Minecraft and Kuya. <laughs> Goober used to be my favorite collaborator. Every time we, uh, we, Jay and I would, uh, be in a call, there's Goober in the background. <laughs> All right, soothing wetlands. Um. I think I need to go this way. 
It kind of cut scene to me over here. Yeah, no, this way. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. No, I... We were still playing... Because uh, we were on PXO, I think, at the time, because I remember uh, Max building, like, a, a little sprout monument at uh, at spawn when he was born or something. He did, like, a uh, sprout pixel art or something. Hey there, Totemo. Welcome back. Looks like you nailed the trial. Congrats on finding the Max Mushrooms. Trial number two is no problem for you. All my other students end up getting lost in the forest. Turns out finding Max Rushers is the least of their problems. It's a shame, but I guess everyone other than Tortimer will fail the trial. <laughs> Suckers! Well, first things first, a proper meal. Let's have the Max Mushrooms made into a delicious Max soup, shall we? We're all gonna dine at Max. Mmm, -hmm. really outdone myself this time. Now all that's left is to add those lovely Max Mushrooms you brought us. Miss Honey, wait! Why, Clara! What in the world has gotten into you? We've never seen you in such a flutter. I've got some X mushrooms too! Oh, oh, nice work, Clara! You must have searched hard for those! Uh, thank you so much for the follow, computer guy. That makes you a second person to pass the second trial. Wow, I did it! I did it! Woo! Chin up, darling girl, you did it! This is a cause for celebration! Master, Miss Sunny, please, can I ask for something just this once? I want you to use my Max Mushrooms in the Max Soup. I really want to share my hard work with everybody here. Oh, Clara. Well, if that's all you're after, then I'm perfectly happy to oblige. Though it's hardly the first time you've asked for something, and I rather doubt it'll be the last. <laughs> Miss Honey! I hope you don't feel that your thunder's being stolen, Tortimer, but we're a family here, and family shares, so we'll go ahead and use Clara's... That just means I get to save them for the next Pokemon I want to make Diagon to Max. Doing well, computer guy. How about yourself? It's just so rare for her to try hard at something. I really want to reward you. <laughs> you understand, don't you? You can hold on to the next mushrooms you found. I'm sure you'll find a good use for them. Yep. I'll, uh... I'm trying to think. Is anybody on my team Gigantamax? I think Tyrion can Gigantamax. Um, we'll use them on somebody. All right. Soup's on. Famous Max Soup at the Master Dojo. Well, I'm famous. Time to dig in. Let's eat. You enjoyed the Max Soup. Oh, I never did explain the big deal about the soup, did I? You see, when one drinks the Dojo's famous Max Soup, you feel Dynamax energy welling up from inside you, don't you? No, you don't. That kind of thing doesn't happen if a human has a soup. But things are a bit different when certain Pokemon drink the soup. You see, oh man, my voice is not conditioned anymore for all these high-pitched and gravelly voices I do. You see, there are some Pokemon that have distinct potential. And when they drink the soup, their Dynamax form will change into a Gigantamax form. I'll keep, I'll keep one of our lads in the kitchen on soup duty from now on, too, so you can ask him to serve a fresh bowl of back soup whenever you need. Now then, let's wrap things up. All you did your best, you all did your best in the second trial, and I'm proud of everyone here. Except for everyone but me failed. Well, me and Clara. And last but not least, thanks for the soup, honey. Thanks for the soup, Miss Honey. Got back from the kitchen, almost got stuck 14 hours from home. Oh, no. Car was acting funny. That's... That's less than ideal. <laughs> By the way, Tornamar, meet me in my room when you have a moment. Whoa! Uh, oh, here we are. Ah, the Kremlomatic. Wait. What ran until... Uh... Oh, got it. We're still talking about PXL. Yeah, I mean, that was still, you know, five years ago or whatever, but, uh, yeah. That, that, PXO was more, was more low-key, though, was a thing. I don't think even I was really recording on that. It was, we just kind of were chilling, hanging out on that one, so. It makes sense. Uh, huh, perfect, now I'm sure to work. All that's left is to fire it up with the on button, so here we go, let's push it. Alright. I don't know any of the Kramomatic recipes, although I know that there's probably some I should look up because they can give me good stuff, but, uh. Must still need more watts. All right. Um, okay, maybe I talk to Mustard first. I think I'm supposed to give that kid some watts. 
Hey, you are, Tortora, Clara, and thanks for coming. So what's all this about, Master? What did you want to tell us? Right, well, I've decided that you two will now take the Master Jojo's final, last, ultimate, third trial. This guy's a total boomy ripoff. The final, last, ultimate, third trial. What's that? Uh, so, uh, so basically this is the last trial? Uh, well, yeah, so that's the gist of it. You two are the only ones who successfully finished the second trial. You've pushed each other to greater heights and helped each other grow. So I'd say it's time to finally see who is stronger in a Dynamax Pokemon battle. We're going to battle? That's the last trial? Yep, the rules are simple. Whoever wins will complete the trial. The winner will be granted the secret armor of the Master Dojo. This is it, finally. But can I... No, you can't beat me, Clara. I'm sorry. The battle will be held in the battle court behind the Master Dojo. This court is a power spot, so you can Dynamax to your Pokemon's, or to your heart's content. Dynamax to my Pokemon's content. I need to go there right away to prepare my pure art for this. I'm going on ahead, okay? You can lance about like a slow poke and take as much time as you need. All right, so I do think... She's got talent, that's for sure, but it's caused her to slack off. She's never felt the need to try hard at anything, I guess. Even with her training here at the dojo, I can tell she's been doing just the bare minimum. But things have changed since she arrived, Tortora. Kuya has donated $10. Thank you so much. To see you back to streaming. <laughs> I've got the Finnish lady uh, reading it out, apparently. Thank you so much for the donation, Kuya. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, maybe you've helped to get some sort of passion out driving her, eh? Still, I only hope that motivation isn't put toward anything mischievous. <laughs> yeah, I actually I greatly appreciate donations. My, uh, as I mentioned, my wife is staying home with our son, uh, which means she's not going back to work, which means uh, our budget is a little tighter than uh, normally would be. So basically anything channel related is going to have to be channel funded going forward. So uh, I do greatly appreciate that. Right now, I think the current goal is it's, it's for a Nintendo Switch uh uh, gift card. Um, there is a slightly more immediate need that the money will probably end up going to. Um, my uh, my mouse for my computer, yes, an actual mouse, um, is is dying. So I need I need to get a new mouse. So uh, it's it's about the same amount of money. Uh, so probably the money will be going towards that. But thank you so much, Kuya. I greatly appreciate uh, your generous donation.